All right, guys. Today's video is a reshoot, cause HKS. No, cause you took him off, cause you blew up your motor, right? Basically. I didn't blow it up. It blew up on itself. Oh yeah, it blew up on itself. So he had. Oh, uh, it's cause the Emperor. This was a, it was a fleet car, so it was like a those cars that they. What do they call it again? They rent. They lent out. No, in Infinity. Oh. It came from Infinity. It was a loaner. It was a loaner. You already know they treat those things like crud, bro. Yeah. So, obviously that went out because I know they're doing like the oil change every 10,000 miles. Because that's what they say it is. But it's really six? No, it's just 10, but I wouldn't do six, dude. Not even. I'll probably do like four. Size. Oh. There you go, guys. So, you have to get a new motor. You have to take those out for warranty reasons. And now they're going back on. Going back on. All right, Eric, explain, explain what's going on. What am I looking at? Where, where am I looking, actually? You got the oil catch can right here. A mod we didn't record. Oh, yeah, because you were being a duck and he didn't want to wait. But you do that. You got the, the JB4. JB4, let's show it. It's in there. Yeah, I did the belt on this car as well. What do you think the best bang for your buck uh, mods are for this car? Like, you know, you only got a thousand bucks. Like a you only got fifteen hundred dollars to spend on mods. What do you? What would you do? For depending on like what you want. Well, you want power? Or do you want like noise? Uh, lower down pipes? No, JB4. Oh, JB4 was uh, six hundred. Six hundred. Yeah, sorry, thousand. I mean, if you're trying to look for power, you get a lower down pipe and. Or you can get heat exchanger. You know, we might, we might have to make this another video because that'll be interesting. Because like, if you want your car running efficient, you definitely need a heat exchanger. Yeah. Because these cars get pretty easy because of these. Because of what? These things right here. They are a water to air cooling. So the charge air goes in here, like the, the boost. Yeah. Goes in here, gets cooled down by these, and then it goes in makes the power cool i'm in you guys heard it here it's crazy because so much psi is going through this all right let's get to it we struggle so much trying to put things off do you see amber yeah <laughs> that was so funny dude because we we're like trying so hard to get these things yeah, Amber, these? Mm -hmm. We couldn't get them off. Fuck. All this shit. Now that I played it smart, I put them where they need to be. So we can get them easier. Hell yeah, I remember now. Yeah, because they're positioned like... We're like stupid. Like, water. you couldn't... Yeah. Because now, I can say that we struggle so much just trying to get these damn hose clamps off, remember? Like, Alright, little update. Eric got the, wait, why, why did you need to take those out? Oh yeah, because these have the... Oh, these have the little hole. Yeah. Oh, uh, I mean, your ball yeah, one. So kind of give them a step-by-step -step of what, what actually needs to, yeah, what you just did. Just fucked the shit out of my car. <laughs> you fucked the shit out of your, what is this? I uh, literally like, fucking went with the, this thing. Yeah, you don't have to be that careful when you, when you work on this you're like that's why we took so long too we're like so careful like don't break nothing you have to worry about shit just fucking there you guys hear it just fucking wing it not wing it also kind of be careful that's like especially like these are all just radiator hoses like this stuff just be careful with this hose mainly but uh, not cool. like uh like you don't gotta worry about shit like you won't break nothing so all you're loosening is uh this one you yeah. got you got Two bolts on this side, two bolts right here. They are 12. Mm -hmm. One right here. And then we got two right here as well, so it's four in total you gotta take out. So it's one, two, three, four. No. But I got three. After changing, they did my motor. They missed one. Let's just zoom. Let's just zoom for. My motor wasn't uh, stable. Plenum, they call it plenum or whatever it's called. 
Anyways, it's a pain in the ass. It's gonna be right behind here. And these things are a pain in the ass. That's why you need this little tool to, you know, boom, pull it out and then rip it out. What were you saying? They don't really need it, right? What? The... Or what to, I forget what was exactly you were. Something, I don't know. Never mind, I forget what I said. Anyways. We're pretty much done, just... Well, I, I say I didn't need it, because remember I put it right here. Oh, yeah. They need it. I don't know. Yeah. That's basically it. This uh, look up. This will take you probably a whole day, especially if it's the first time doing it. It's gonna suck. Yeah, so it's just... It's all about being patient. I end up like this guy dropping his phone in the engine bay. Oh, yeah. I'm trying to rip out the whole motor. <laughs> you know? It was a day of frustration, and just losing the phone was the cherry on top. My phone. All right, so we're just uh, gonna put on the blow valves. They go in these boots over there, and just run the lines, and that's it. All right, guys, we got the car on. All right, it's gonna let it rip. It's not warmed up yet. Not right? oh, damn, missed it. Okay. There you go. <laughs> She's loud. I forgot how loud it was. Yeah, sounds cool. Only for four ninety nine. How much was it? How much is it? the blood loss? Oh, uh, six. Oh, I did four. You could do higher, but. <laughs> Alright, guys, see you in the next video, which is gonna be a car meet.